Hi guys, Karen here with another video. Welcome back to our channel and thank you so much for watching. So as you can tell from the title, I'm doing a post review post. Um, this is a review of the Hunter Boots after three years. And this is because I have run into a little bit of a problem. So let's go through all the pros. So I we purchased all of our boots um, in 2020. And so um, we have rain boots before, but I hadn't delved into the Hunter boots yet. And um, I wanted to purchase them because I knew we would do a lot of gardening. And during that time of the year, we get a lot of rain. And I was pulling them out again because we've had quite a bit of rain this these last couple of days. And so, you know, I decided, okay, it's time to get out our rain boots. Um, so like I said, I bought them all in 2020. Yes, some of them are a bit dusty. The, I, so the Hubster has his pair. Maya has the uh, slender ones here. Um, and these are mine. And we use them, obviously. You can tell they're used. And um, so I will say this. They're very, very good. Very um uh insulated um you you can wear long socks with them um you should wear long socks with them i don't think you need the uh, hunter socks that you can buy they're so super thick those are great if you live in a place that gets really cold but for the most part we could just wear um long socks um the kit is really great in terms of keeping that rubber um, really clean and everything after we use them we tend to wait a couple of days to rinse it off and then uh, clean off the boots with the rubber care kit um, and like I said these boots get a lot of use in terms of um, in gardening my husband uses them when he's cutting grass and all of when he's doing you know yard stuff he uses them um, you know, if it's raining outside, we're using them. Um, they're not like we're not just looking at the boots. Uh, what else can I say? Um, they come in a multitude of colors. Um, very comfortable to wear. Very comfortable. Um, if you uh, are looking to like um, for comfort, if something I've heard of some rain boots that are really tight. Um, these are not. OK, so and these are the short version of them after and also there is a warranty it's a limited warranty and now i found out that the warranty is 24 months yes so we bought them all at the i bought all three of these at the same time in 2020 march of 2020 and then purchased uh maya got hers march i mean april 2020 and then other people in our family bought them as well now, out of everybody having hunter boots, and even out of my hunter boots, so I have these two here. I have um, the UNC blue, <laughs> and then I have um, the purple. Um, however, so all of these, the all of these are fine. You know, I, I would say the person who utilizes their boots, it, they have them in heavy, heavy rotation would be the Hubster's boots, right? But I noticed on these, on my boots, on the inside, that it split. And that there was a tear here. And funny enough, I was like, how did that happen? So on the inside here, let me see. Let me put it more in the light so you can see. There's a tear here. And oh, mind you, it's a split in the rubber itself. It's not going all the way through. The same with this side. It's a split in the rubber. It's not going all the way through. It's not happened to any of the other boots. And my other daughter who has hunter boots, nothing's happened to her boots as well. And for me, these... I've worn these and what I like to do with my boots is I switch back and forth to make sure that I balance the wear and tear. So these, the blue ones, don't have an issue at all here. With that being said, let me look. 
yeah no issues at all let me check out other people's boots nope nope so when i called this shoe is no longer under warranty so um you know you can't send it back or anything i can't i can't send it back or what have you um I can't send it back for free <laughs> or get it repaired for free. Um, so all that to say, it could just be a fluke. I looked online at other reviews and people are saying the same thing. Like it's kind of random. Um, some people actually have the crinkling in the front. Uh, it just depends. But um, no one else's boots are like that. So would I still purchase them again? Yes. I think it's a good quality boot. I just think, um, you know, I would take more care. But then again, that's assuming that I did something. But how could I do something right there? You know, on both sides. That's the problem. On both sides. Um, and it not happen on this side. So could it be something in the rubber um, the exposure, uh, I have no idea, but let me know in the comments below if you all have hunter boots. Um, I still like them absolutely because one out of four or one out of five, you know, um, with the tear it's, it still works and I'm still going to wear them when it's raining. As long as it's not raining hard, if it's like torrential downpour, I'm wearing these because they, you know, they don't have any punctures or holes or anything. And there are no holes at the bottom. Um, but these, if it's a light rain or something like that, and um, I'm not, you know, or if we're washing the car or something like that, I, you know, I wouldn't wear these if I'm washing the car, I'll wear these. Um, but if it's just a light rain or a drizzle or something like that, I would definitely wear these. But um, yeah, I thought I would share that with you guys because it kind of was mind boggling. Um and unexpected and I just found it this morning and I was kind of like hmm how did that happen and we all just kind of stopped and stared and looked and I gave Hunter Boots a call and yeah to see what the warranty time was uh, or to remind you know to, to get a reminder of what the warranty time was and you know sadly it's past the warranty and uh, but you know uh i still think it's a great brand to have like i said one out of five we have five pairs of boots uh, my other daughter has hers they're the fire engine red color q color um and hers are fine too and this is the short boot um it has great like i said it has great room it's um it's very comfortable and I think that's why I'm kind of sad because I'm like, ah, uh, and I'm not getting rid of them. But I just wanted to let you all know to make you all aware. Um, so I hope you guys found this video helpful. Let me know what you think in the comments below and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye. And don't forget, if you order them, get the rubber kit. <laughs> get the rubber care kit. <laughs>